Hey, what's up, tech fans? Welcome back to the channel where we're continuing our coverage of E3 2019. Now, Bethesda, they had some pretty cool stuff. They start off their press conference with a touching commercial thanking gamers and pretty much letting them know that they're the reason they exist. Well, obviously, we're the ones giving them all the cash. Now, they showed us an update on Elder Scrolls Blades, which included a custom jewelry system, solo arena battle, and even a new dragon quest line. Now, this is available immediately following the conference. This game is also coming to Nintendo Switch in the fall of 2019. So get your game on right after the show. Now, next up were some Fallout 76 updates with the Wastelanders update, which includes human NPCs, and this is free for all the players of the game. It'll be out in the fall of 2019. They also announced a free trial week for the full Fallout 76 game starting today. So you can try it and see if you like it. Also with FO76 was a nuclear winner update, brr, which is a 52 player battle royale with exclusive perks, which is also free for owners of Fallout 76. Next up was an announcement for Ghostwire Tokyo an action-adventure game with supernatural elements from Tango Gameworks. It looks pretty interesting. People disappear from the streets of Tokyo, and your mission is to find out why. I mean, maybe there's a sushi sale. Now, there was another Elder Scrolls update announced with new DLCs Scalebreaker and Dragonhold, in which they showed a trailer for The Season of the Dragon Continues. ZeniMax Online Studios also revealed a free-to-play mobile game, Commander Keen, which was originally from ID Software in the 90s. It's now available on iOS and Android, and they announced there'll be a soft launch this summer. There's also a new game trailer for the Elder Scrolls Legends Strategy card game. Now, this will be available on mobile devices for absolutely free. Bethesda also showed upcoming updates in Rage 2 with new vehicles, enemy, and even, ah, should I say it, cheats. And this is all for free coming later this year. Now for those folks of VR, they also announced Wolfenstein Cyberpilot, which is a Wolfenstein VR game coming this July. They also showed us more Wolfenstein Youngblood trailers as well and what I think was some actual gameplay. I'm not actually sure, but it does feature a co-op mode, which they did show. Now, this game will be out on July 26, 2019, across pretty much all platforms, PS4, Xbox One, Switch, and the PC. Next up, Arcane Lion Studios announced their game, Deathloop, which had an interesting trailer about a couple of assassins with opposite views of a lawless island. No release date was actually announced, and the trailer looked okay. Bethesda also revealed Orion, a game streaming service that's able to stream games seamlessly at max settings with little bandwidth. But can it play Doom though? And it sounds an awful like cloud gaming to me. They did show off Doom at 4K with 60 frames per second stream to a mobile device, and it did look pretty damn smooth. They also announced you can stream Doom for free by joining and registering at slayersclub.com. Now, doesn't that sound a bit like a fan club for the band, Slayer? Bethesda also showed the Doom Eternal trailer. Now, this looks absolutely cool, and the game looks brutal as well. I'm a big fan of the Doom series since the beginning game to now, so you know I'm going to be playing this. Now, this game's also going to be available on November 22nd, just in time for Thanksgiving. Now, the last thing that Bethesda announced was a Doom multiplayer mode called Battle Mode, which is two demons versus a Slayer. Now, they really didn't get into too much detail. They said they released more information at QuakeCom, which they've now re-aptly named DoomCom. So that covers Bethesda's announcements at E3 2019. If you'd like to get some more information, we will have the links down below. And if you like what you saw, hey, subscribe to the channel and make sure you turn that notifications bell on so that you can see all of our videos in your channel. I'm Elric. Thanks for watching. We'll see you back here for more tech tomorrow.